All right, hello everyone. Uh, welcome back to the channel. Uh, and specifically the model for two series. I realize I haven't recorded an episode for this in um <clears throat> in about four months, and I do apologize for that. Uh, because I'm a bit short of time, I'm not gonna say much in this beginning bit. Uh, last episode we played these two missions: Second Son Must Go Tell, and this episode we're gonna play Loose End and the Enemy of My Enemy. So without further ado, let's get to it. Also, I'm gonna be playing on Recruit because. Well, last time I record, tried, attempted to record this, then uh, playing on, I played on regular, and it was a disaster, and it didn't go well at all. So, what I'm gonna do today is, I'm, eh, to, to gay? today I'm gonna play on uh, recruit and try to um, not die so much. So. uh... Yeah, here's Shepard going on about his uh, blank check and that he's gonna obsess over Magrov with it. Despite what the world may say, we are not savages. We don't kill civilians. We use precision. And yeah, he's going on more and more and more about how awesome they are and what he's gonna do to Magrov and the fact that he's gonna write history. And skip. All right. Time to get into this mission. Like I said earlier, I'm a bit rushed for time, so uh, not gonna put as much effort into this. And press an old C to invade. Hey, look, I can shoot it. And it's exploded. And I'm dead. Oh, wait, no, never mind. I am alive. Okay, kill those people. Man, these guys do so much damage. And rushing through here. Uh, if I go a bit silent while I'm playing this game, or while I'm shooting and firing at people, I do apologize. Uh, that's just me focusing and trying not to die. And they're all dead. Uh, this is already going a lot better than it did last time I tried to record this. Oh, I thought he was an enemy. Uh, this is why you play on recruit. You just blitz through everyone. And now for the really long, boring bits of the game where you just have to, uh... Oh, almost die. The uh, long boring bits where you just have to breach through here and then kill everyone really easily because it's in slow motion. Now let's play the game of where are they? There they are, there's his face, and there's his face, and there's his face, and now they're all dead. And now I have to go down there. Hello. Hello. Okay. We go through here. Refill my ammunition. Get a get a vector. Okay. Destroy that. <laughs> I have a knack for destroying TVs, guys. If you didn't know that already. If this is for some reason the first time you're watching this series on the uh, like sixth or seventh episode, whatever this is, this is the seventh episode. Yeah, if this is your first time watching and you just started watching on the seventh episode, then you you won't know until just now that I have a knack for destroying TVs in any game. So yeah, I hope that doesn't annoy you guys. Honestly, if that's the kind of thing that annoys you, then who are you? But, 
Yeah. Oh, I have to go through here and plant DSM. Plant DSM. Plant DSM. I like how he has folders that have no name. Like... The, these folders are just blank, and then there's supposedly a rubbish bin, and then just a taskbar that has nothing. Perhaps they were trying to model this after Windows, like Windows Vista, because that's around the time that this was out. But they, they couldn't due to copyright or something. So they just made it look kind of like this one. So yeah, Captain Price is going on about his uh, stuff. Oh, whoops, I just threw a grenade. Whoops. Wow, I almost killed myself with that. Yeah, that's why you don't give me some weapons and explosives, because then, then bad things will happen. Particularly uh, on the explosive side of things. Alright, now what I'm going to do is I'm going to plant a uh, claymore there, and plant a claymore there, and I'm going to go through here. Uh, yeah, your recommendation is switching to scope weapons. It's not gonna do much for me, considering I didn't get one. There could be one over here. Ooh, L86 scoped. Ah, uh, yeah, sure, let's take it. Ooh, 420 bullets. No, no you don't. Well, Ozone is already down, and they've already breached through here. Oh, Scarecrow's already down. Shoot. Okay. Um... Yeah, this just got interesting. I I completely let my guard down, and uh, and now I have no one else but me guarding this area. Ooh, with the L86. Ooh, it's pretty good. That reloads a lot faster. That reloads a lot faster than the M240, the gun that I was trying to use the last time I recorded this. Okay, let's see. Is there anyone around here? Oh, gosh. Scarecrow's dead. Where did Scarecrow go? Yeah, for some reason they're not shooting the DSM. Like, are the enemies just that dumb? Ooh, game saved. Good. Right. 30 seconds. Oh, great. Alright, kill that guy. Ooh, kill that guy. And run away because that's grenade. Oh, goodness. Kill that guy. I don't use the melee enough in this game. Nope, oh, you did. That's a flashbang. And those are guys. Oh, they didn't flash me enough to be able to blind me. I can still see everyone. So they're dead. Ah, they shot up and destroyed it. Oh, great, and now this checkpoint is going to reload at a point where the Scarecrow's dead, so... Oh, gosh. And they shot up and destroyed it again. Oh, no.
Man, this is getting really butt clenchy now. I say butt clenchy, that basically just means it's a really tense situation. I'm really on the edge of my seat now. Okay. Flash got me a little bit. Oh my gosh, they keep flashing the area. Fine, I'll flash it too. Man, I'm gonna be deaf by the time I get back home. Jeez. Man, I like the L86. This gun is amazing. No, you don't. No, you don't. Okay. Gosh, 0 0.16 megabits per second transfer. Really? On my. There we go. 30 megabits per second. Also, I like how it assumes that all of these files are like one megabit in size. Yeah, one megabyte in size. Because at 30 megabits per second, it downloads like 30 files a second. It's like, are all of these files really just one megabyte in size? Or however that works. Ooh, yes. Okay, transfer is complete. Finally. Okay. What I'm going to do is... They're almost at the LZ. What I'm going to do is, I'm going to um, stock my ammunition just real quick. And I'm going to run really quickly to try and catch up with my guys. Okay, I'm going a bit silent again, guys. I do apologize. Oh, there's Ghost. Okay. Okay, good. Uh, let's see. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ghost. Okay. Here's Ghost. Okay, last time I recorded this, I didn't have a grenade launcher. This time I do. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try and not die. I'm just going to run. Okay. Getting a little bit tense now. Oh, yes, made it. Made it without dying. That was amazing. Oh, man. If this recording glitches out or cuts off or something, I'm going to be really upset. Or if the sound isn't all right, I'm going to be really upset because this is... This is going well. Man, I should just play and recruit. <laughs> okay. Yep, he's uh, destroying stuff. Look at him go. Etc. Okay. Alright. And here comes the man himself, General Shepard. Got it, sir. And he shoots. Me and him. Uh, they could have made this character look a lot more like a jerk if they just gave him an apple. Like, just eating an apple casually as he shoots us. Oh, man. I like a mod for this game that just has him eating an apple. And there they go, throwing me. Ow, ow, ow. And throwing him. Wow, look at him. Slow motion and all. Wow. It's really sad. Look at him. Look at me. I love you, Ghost. And now they're, they're, they're pouring gasoline on us. He's smoking a cigar. And he's going to throw it on us.
And there it goes. Uh, so the game gets a bit interesting at this point. Pretty much, you you have a lot less friendlies to go with, and just everyone wants to kill you. Also, I wonder what Sergeant Foley, and like, Private whatever his name was, and Corporal Dunn, I wonder what they're doing right now, because they're on General Shepard's side. I wonder what they're doing at this point. Because I remember in Episode 5, when I completed Whiskey Hotel, or what should be Episode 6 at this point, that at the end of that episode, it showed them, like, they were talking about what they're going to do when they get to Russia and that they're going to burn it down, and then the game doesn't focus on them at all anymore. I wonder what they're doing right now, considering that they're a part of an army that is, like, evil. <laughs> okay, I'm just going to blitz through this part here, shoot that guy. Going this way. Realize that's a dead end. Go the other way. Shoot that guy just for fun. <laughs> Shoot him just for fun, you know? It's always, it's always a, a nice pastime just to go out shooting. Uh, I'm, I'm kidding, of course. Sorry. Oh, man. Okay. What? There's a dog? Shoot him. Oh, and run this way, because I'm about to die. Okay. Oh, that's a grenade. Okay. Totally didn't just jump there. Oop. Kill him. Run this way. Try not to die at all. That's that guy. That's this guy. Oh man, I, I miss using the knife in games. Oh man, Call of Duty 3 was amazing for using the melee weapon on people. You just run up, hit them, run away, juke out the guy that's firing at you, run up, knife him, and then just continue running the other way. Where is the other way? Okay. Making it through the mission pretty quick, guys. Man, I love playing on recruit. Okay. And Nikolai is now muttering to himself on the radio. Kill those two guys. Really, no limit to how fast this thing fires, which I. Very nice. Uh, let's go over here. Try to get a shot on that turret. There he is. And now he's dead. And the minigun whips back to the uh, frontal position. Because. Why wouldn't it? Uh, oh, there's the guy that's shooting me. Okay, well, he's dead. Okay, it looks pretty safe. Let's go. Yeah, I know. That's what I'm doing. I am moving. Oh my gosh, okay. Okay. Yeah, on Recruit, they really don't do that much damage to you, so I'm just gonna try and run past them. Okay. Or, or... Or everyone can just shoot at me. That works too. Okay, so I'm gonna ride this way. Oh, yes! There's the guy. Ooh, and I actually have ammunition in my MP5 this time. Oh, man, this is amazing. Ooh, and I have 330 bullets. It even refilled. Okay. Ooh, bulletproof glass. Oh, how oh, nice. Either that, or they just couldn't be... Oh, eh. They couldn't be bothered to uh, model glass matching on a moving vehicle. That's probably what happened. Right, so... Oh, shoot. Okay, there's guys. And they're dead. And I'm almost dead. 
Just casually waiting. Ooh, I think I shot that driver in the head. That was nice. Kill that guy. And he's dead. Are you gonna go? There you go. Yeah, let's do this. Rook. That's a nice name. Yeah, that was nice. Alright, cool. And that's it. And that's the episode. I wonder how long that was. That wasn't too long. That, that was probably like a, maybe a 20 minute episode. Maybe even less than that. Maybe only like 15. I don't know. It could be 30 minutes and all of you are just laughing at me. Uh, okay. And that is the end of episode 7. I hope you guys enjoyed uh, episode 8. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm before I record episode 8 and obviously upload it, I'm going to try and uh, fix the episodes on YouTube currently because on current eh, on YouTube currently episode 5 is actually um, episode 6 and this is episode 7 and I forgot to upload the actual episode 5 so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fix that also episode 4 it gets a bit cut off at the end so you guys don't see me play the gulag apologies for that I can't really fix it I'm sorry guys but and I don't really have time to re-record that episode so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna fix the episodes on YouTube rename episode 5 to episode uh, 6 I'm going to upload the actual episode 5 then I'm gonna upload this episode then I'm gonna record episode 8 and we will finish the series and I will probably play something else so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed um, I'll see you all in the next video stay awesome everyone